Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. Well, we got some uh, nice weather out there for today. We got warm, dry conditions, uh, temperatures in the 80s. The humidity's dropped compared to a couple days ago. And the high temperature is going to be in the 80s for the next few days. Now, we're going to be dry through the weekend and uh, no rain expected, which we do need some rain. I mean, we just finished out the month of August with 1.21 inches of rain, and, you know, that was well below the average of 5.88. So, uh, yeah, we need some rain. Now, it's not in the cards for us the next few days. We got some. Uh, Mild dry air on the way for today. Uh, the coolness is pouring in, but we'll have so much sunshine. I wouldn't call it cool out when you're hitting, you know, mid to upper 80s out there, but I would call it mild for us. But there is some coolness in the northeast. And they got a reinforcing shot, which will come down here this weekend and uh, keep the temperatures about the same. So, highs in the mid 80s for us. Uh, look at these 70s up in the Northeast. We got uh, 60s and 70s, I think, even. Wow. Uh, 80s in the Midwest. Uh, we'll be about as warm as Chicago, which is interesting, and it'll be even warmer over towards Minneapolis. So, there's some heat in the central U.S. You might be keep hearing about the, the western heat, the western United States. Pretty rough over there. They're going for highs in the 100s. We'll be in the mid 80s and holding uh, today, Friday. And Saturday, pretty much. I think we might even drop a little more going into uh, Sunday. Humidity levels, not bad. I think we're going to be between 60 and 65 for that dew point over the next few days. And um, so that's, you know, still some moderate humidity. It's still a little bit humid, but compared to what it was, it was about 70 to 75. That big drop in the dew points has made for some nice weather. Yesterday, we got a taste of it. We'll get even more of that today. So, Super Doppler 10 radar, right now it is rain free, and we're going to stay rain free. Future track, this is really fast. Yeah, today, lots of sunshine this morning. Going into midday, mostly sunny skies. Going into the afternoon, mostly sunny. No rain. We'll have a wind generally out of the north, 10 miles an hour, maybe a little out of the northeast for a bit. And here's 6 p.m., mostly sunny skies. We're mostly clear overnight, no rain. And then tomorrow, almost a repeat, lots of sunshine. Models trying to throw in a shower, not buying it. Going to go with a uh, just straight up dry forecast for us. I think the air's too dry, the models not picking up on that. Now, our temperatures today 85 Virginia Beach, 86 Norfolk, 84 in Hampton, 89 in Williamsburg. 88 New uh, Elizabeth City and some mid 80s along the shore. Mostly sunny, nice weather, north winds 10 miles an hour. Looking good at the beaches, waves to two feet, low threat for rip currents, water temps are in the upper 70s. So the tropics, well, there's uh, three disturbances we're watching. This one's got a high chance of formation in the north central Atlantic, but that's going to stay out to sea. This one over in the eastern Atlantic probably stays out to sea, and now it looks like even this one that's got a high chance of formation is going to stay out to sea. Almost all the models keep it out there. Now some of them are even taking it east of Bermuda, so that's Good. Maybe they'll be spared that storm, but uh, yeah, definitely not coming around here. The only thing is, if it revs up offshore, it could bring us a higher threat for rip currents towards Monday, uh, towards Labor Day. Even though it would stay out to sea, it could send us that, but we'll see. Either way, we got a lot of sunshine, and the weekend's looking good and just really nice weather for a while.